Ted, if you had three wishes for your life in the world that would instantly come true, what would they be? Well, number one, that uh, every single country got rid of all their dictators so that everybody would be free. Number two, that the uh, individuals were free to become and interested in becoming even more and bigger. Uh, lots. Of, I believe that there's a entrepreneur inside the heart of everyone, inside the fiber, inside the being of everyone. And for more people to recognize that the true heroes are the entrepreneurs who are creating the jobs. You know, 90% of all new jobs are created by entrepreneurs, not big businesses. And when people understand that entrepreneurship is the only real way to create wealth which can be used not to spend by the people who create it although that's part of the joy of it part of the joy but I think most of the joy is all the great things you can do with it in uh, charitable uh, activities and and things that you your church activities if that's what you're motivated to, to do and to help I just think that's a fantastic thing and the third thing that I'd like to see people do is recognize that their number one asset is their health. And when I look at Americans, 60% of which are, are, are obese, and that's spreading like wild, that obesity issue all over the world, when people realize that their life is finite, that they can extend their lives by, by being healthy, that we're within 10 years of breakthrough, more breakthroughs, we'll all be able to live to be 120 years or more barring accidents and, and, and uh, that sort of thing, so that when pe more people recognize that health is a value, it's worth pursuing, they watch their exercise, their diet, uh, and they also learn that the mental food that you feed yourself is so critical. I would like it if 100% of the world were on that premise. Uh, we would have even a better world if all those three things happened.